So here we go, we've got a V-Dub Amarok with the two litre. I reckon it's a pretty famous and well-known and well-proven engine. This thing's got single turbos, twin turbos, you name it. This motor's been in cars, vans, wagons, the whole lot. But we've put something on here, you can see it's really needed. It's only quite new, the engine, but as usual with these thin oils, we've got a lot of blow-by and a lot of breathing fumes. So the CAT scan's obviously going to pay dividends very, very quickly on this engine because you're under a lot of load all the time. You want everything as efficient as possible. Not only that, this thing's got diesel particulate filter on the exhaust. We definitely don't want these oily fumes burning through the combustion process, which in turn we challenge the fact that just adds more to the soot going down the pipe there. But all that said, the big argument is, is it oil that's damaging DPFs or is it fuel quality? And I say oil's probably not really the main culprit because these engines aren't really eating a lot of oil up. Certainly this steam burning in there can't be helping anything. But remember, you've used thousands of litres of fuel between every service and nobody knows what that fuel quality is like. So a lot of these DPF issues, are a lot of the times that we reckon, caused by the fuel here, sooting things up, driving conditions that are probably outside the square from what the manufacturer wants. Amongst other things, of course, all these thin oils. And yes, they might use a little bit when they're using these thin oils. So our recommendation, try and chase up a good DPF safe 1540 oil or higher for your DPF engine. Fit a catch can ASAP as soon as you get it. No 2017 model diesel runs around without a DPF from what we've seen. Every single one on the road now is getting sold with a DPF in 2017. And these are the fumes you've got. So put a catch can on and when you get it serviced, we don't recommend to do it like some of these things say by the book 15 to 20,000, maximum of 10,000 Ks with oil. And then get your mechanics to do a DPF burn, a forced regen. Every service that it comes in, I think it's a load of baloney saying that they've only got a certain number of regen cycles that they can burn. We prefer to say they don't. We've been doing these things for a long time. We've certainly resuscitated lots of DPFs that were failing by doing a list of things including proper burns. So get the right advice in the first place, put on a catch can on your modern diesel, the best thing you can do. I'm Andrew from Berrima Diesel, you can watch more of these on Facebook, YouTube or go to our berrimadiesel.com website.